Life was at best until my 21 years. I discovered a lump in my breast. And as the day goes on, the lump got increasing in size. So I was scared and confused about the sudden change in my breast. So I went to be diagnosed. Then on the 31st of January 2017, I was diagnosed with infiltrating ductal carcinoma grade 2. The word cancer was a pain that I was feeling. The word alone got me so scared and confused. The word cancer got me discouraged about life. The word cancer made me feel why. I asked myself questions, why? But I said to myself, I am stronger than cancer. I said to myself, cancer has brought the storm, but right now I am the storm. I said to myself, I must leave. I said to myself, it is just for now and not forever. I said to myself, cancer is a word and not a sentence. It is never a life sentence. Then I got more confused on how to go about it. I wanted the best oncologist. I wanted a best treatment for myself because I never want this word cancer to flash back again in my life. So I came across Oncology India. When I stepped in, the entrance into the hospital Oncology India, my spirit was fulfilled with the warmth welcoming. Then I met with Dr. Aditi Bats. I met with Dr. Linu Jacob. They were awesome. Dr. Aditi and Dr. Linu Jacob, their treatment, apart from the treatment, their mental support, their moral support gave me more strength for me to conquer the word cancer. Then along the line, I took my six cycles with them in Oncology India. Then I felt my life coming back. I felt everything that was lost was never lost. I got myself back. I got my life back. Now I feel alive. They treated me so well. I am so happy that I came across this very person. And I also want to thank God. The treatment went well. The doctors, the nurses, the way they attended to me throughout my circles were so, so awesome. They were great. So I want to thank and appreciate Oncology India. In person, I want to appreciate Dr. Aditi Bat and Dr. Linu Jacob. I want to appreciate the Almighty God that saw me through. Only by His grace, I am alive today because many people, for the fear of the word cancer, could not live to testify. But today, I thank God for seeing me through the stormy days. Today, I am alive and I am well. I thank God for everything. Thank you.